Welcome to another segment of Manifest with SII Power with your host Dwight Lee. And on this segment, we're going to be talking about the power of suggestion. Before we quantum jump into that, if you've been getting great value out of the channel, you're enjoying the content expressed on this channel, please subscribe to the channel by hitting the subscribe button and turning your notification bell on so you get a notification when a new video drops. Also like the video, the thumbs up helps harmonize with the algorithm so other YouTube searchers can find this uh, type of content and video. And then don't forget to comment on your favorite videos. The power of suggestion. What I wanna talk about is Napoleon Hill and Think and Grow Rich um, kind of introduces us to uh, suggestion and it's it's hetero suggestion right uh, coming from outside of yourself and then it's conscious auto suggestion you suggesting things to yourself now the truth is you are the most valuable player meaning that your suggestion um, carries more weight than others if you are awake so you are the suggester suggesting to yourself but uh, there are some other forms of suggestion that William Walker Atkinson um, expounded up on, you know, um, picking up, I guess, where Napoleon Hill started. And it's the suggestion of authority, uh, the suggestion of association, uh, the suggestion of habit, uh, the suggestion of imitation. <clears throat> And the suggestion, of course, of repetition. And that's mainly what um, Napoleon Hill was referring to uh, in Think and Grow Rich. Uh, he was telling about the power uh, through time, space, repetition of using suggestion. Now, there's nothing complicated about this. Uh, it's the same as some people call it the mental diet, um, you know, self-talk. Um, internal dialogue, inner conversation. The point that's to be driven home uh, is there's different types. Um, you know, you can just think about the suggestion of authority, right? When your parents or, you know, an elder says something to you, especially when it's negative, it has impact on you. That is an example of um, the suggestion of authority. And I think the most important thing that I want to drive home in this video is that you're suggesting things to yourself all the time and others are also suggesting to you all the time. The question is, are you unconscious of it or are you conscious of it? Here's why you want to be conscious of it, because these things can slip into your subconscious and you wonder why all of a sudden you don't feel so good or your confidence has been sapped or your energy has been sapped, you know, so on and so forth. This is why you have to be uh, cognizant. You have to be conscientious. You have to be mindful of awareness, right? Be aware of what you're thinking, what you're feeling, the story that you're telling yourself. And you have to protect your energy at all costs. You have to protect your environment because there is a such thing as thought interference and you are suggesting stuff to yourself and others are also suggesting things to you and things are getting into your consciousness, right? Via your conscious mind and subconscious mind. And if you're not aware of it, it's doing damage because you're not aware of it. You can't select on if you wanted to let it pass through or you want to cancel it, right? Or let it or let it flow by. I um, hope I'm making sense here. Uh, but yeah, we've been talking about um, suggestion, right? The hetero suggestion and conscious auto suggestion that Napoleon Hill referred to in the book Think and Grow Rich. And then the other types that William Walker Atkinson referred to. And uh, these are powerful. Um, so just to recap again, uh, in addition to what Napoleon Hill talked about, conscious 
auto suggestion and hetero suggestion suggestions coming from outside of yourself. There's the suggestion of authority, of association, of habit, imitation, and repetition, which is uh, basically what Napoleon Hill introduced us to in the book Think and Grow Rich. We've been live on Manifest with SII Power, which I host Dwight Lee, talking about the power of suggestion and the types of suggestions and revealing to you that you are the suggester suggesting to your own self and that what you say to yourself has more weight than anything else. Uh, if you've been enjoying this channel and getting great value out of content expressed on this channel, please subscribe to the channel, turn the notification bell on so you get notification when a new video drops. Um, like the video, a thumbs up helps harmonize with the algorithm so others can find this video. And please um, comment on your favorite videos. I leave you with what Neville said, right? Neville said that you're already the person you desire to be. Your unwillingness to believe it is the only reason that you don't see it. And then he also said that though it be false, an assumption persisted in would harden into fact. 